everything we own practically is under this pavilion. But here's the railing. Now it is, you can see, it's it's of some age, but I think it's about as old as our house is. Our house is about 30, I think about 32 years old. And this is probably from a house that was um, about the same age. And it doesn't really matter. Uh, it doesn't have to match up, but it's about from that that age. Now, like I said earlier uh, in, in the intro that we have to, um, do a little sanding on this. Now I brought my drill over. I'm gonna see how it works just to show you. Now something else I could do, if I wanna go through all this trouble, it was, I can do it. And I think it'd be easier when it's when it's up on um, the porch, you know, installed. I think that I could, um, uh, power wash this off and my power washer I have a power washer that's electric and electric ones are not that powerful they're more like you know household clean the driveway off wash your car with um, strength uh, I do have a gas powered one I have access to actually it's not mine but um, it's being kept here and I was told I can use it anytime I want and it's much more powerful and i may do that that would save me a lot because you can see i'm just picking this off with my finger you know now this thing will work and i am going to get set up uh, i'm going to do all the measurement we're going to have left over rail it because as you can see like it goes from here to here i think it's about it looks to be about eight feet each eight, eight foot each of uh railing so i'll have one i'll use two long ones and then there's one two three four five sections and um i think it's better i think it's better that we use uh used railing as well and it's being protected too. It's not going to get rained on, so it's not going to rot away. It's not like it's exposed uh, too badly. But it does take a little bit of measurement, some cutting, and it has to be strategic too because you can't have it come like right in the middle of a rung. And so I'm going to get busy. I'm going to get set up over there, and it will take me a couple minutes. But through the magic of YouTube, you don't have to wait as long.
right, what I'm doing here is I'm getting the section ready to go up. I had to put a couple blocks on the porch to give it an even space underneath for the first section and then the following sections. I'm trying to get this thing in there. It is cut just slightly bigger than the posts are wide to give it a good snug feeling. It does take a couple tries because I'm working by myself. And it did get a little stuck. After a little trial and error, I do get it fit it uh, right and I put it up on each section. Um, the important part was, as I stated earlier, that um, each of the, the rungs have to be in a position that they're the same distance from the posts as much as possible. Uh, as it turns out, in the end, I did make it uh, look pretty good. <clears throat> if you look closely, you will see a couple mistakes, but that's kind of a given. Um, this is part of the trial and error thing. I don't know that it's um, it was so hard to do as it was having to uh, drill these holes that you're seeing me drill right now. I had to use <clears throat> two different bits. If I had two drills, it would have been a lot easier. Uh, that way I could just leave the bit, which turned really hot, in between. And I had to drop it off and just kind of pick it up gingerly as I put it back in the drill again and did the, uh, the holes, each one of them. And it, was, it turned out to be a lot easier than I thought it would be. The hard part, again, is um, making sure that you get all the rungs centered and all the uh, sections even. So use the same block. I used two different four, actually I used four by four blocks uh, that were from a post <coughs> that uh, I used to keep it level. Let's see how big, or I could be dead. Here is the railing all done. And I think it looks great. Has a few touches I gotta finish up on. 
not uh, cosmetically, yes, we have to paint it. But that's going to be our uh, different video. Anyway, there it is. Step back a little bit. My wife and I hung, rehung the uh, planters up there with different uh, bottoms to them. I had to do it. So I think it turned out great. So thanks for watching this video. It was a lot of fun putting this up. Uh, it didn't take me too long. I'll take this one day. It was done. So, uh, if you like what you saw, give us a thumbs up. Share our videos with your friends and family. Uh, and subscribe. It's all free. And it really helps our channel. The channel is growing. Thank you for all those new subscribers. And we will catch you on the next video. It's going to be paint day next time we get together. Have a great one. Bye for now.